encounter i reach the last input string that means i encounter blank symbol i write uh, i will not write anything and move towards left that means now the tape head will point to the lsb of the ones complement okay now i am i am in a new state q1 now from q1 if the lsb is zero and i am adding one to it okay then there will be no carry so it will be so with a zero i am writing it as one and moving towards left so now i am adding one so so it's zero i am writing it as one and moving towards left okay with one and in q3 what will happen i am uh, i will write the remaining things as it is because there is no carry so i'll uh, i'll just uh, i'll not write anything new into the cell and i'll proceed so if it is a zero then i'll not write anything i'll just simply write zero and move towards left if i have one then i will not write anything and move towards left okay and from here if i have blank that means i have reaches the leftmost thing here okay that means i have completed computing the two's complement so i will not write anything and move towards right and reach the final state qf any doubt no sir okay now let us see a new example that is where carry will be there okay so suppose 1100 okay so after doing one's complement what will be the cell content it will be 0011 11. and if i am adding one what will happen it will write zero it will propagate a carry one that one with uh, this one will again write zero and it will propagate a one then it will write one here and the remaining will be zero understood okay. so so now after one's complement that is 0011 i am in state q1 okay now i have seen that my lsb now contains one okay now in order to distinguish the state i have to enter into a new state q4 okay with one what will happen i will write zero and move towards left understood any doubt no sir okay now in q4 represents what q4 represents i am in a state where i have a carry okay so if i am adding one to it then what is happening the cell content will be zero and i will remain in that state and the tape head will move left this represents the second one thing this one so when i am uh, i am propagating a carry i have propagated a carry and i am adding that carry with this one so one one will be zero and again the carry will be propagated okay so again i will remain in state q4 now now in this state when the input symbol is zero now but i have a carry what i will do i have a zero i will write one and move towards left sorry 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 just a second i have uh, i should go to q3 because the q3 represents the state where there is no carry okay so in q4 if i have zero i should write one move towards left and the state machine should switch to the state q3 where there is no carry now in q3 what will happen if if i get any zero or one i will write that and move towards left understood just uh, digest this thing means try to understand and uh, let me know if any doubt hello yes, 
ओके नो प्रॉब्लम ना नो सर ओके ओके सो नाउ लेट अस ट्राई टू सी अनदर प्रॉब्लम आई होप यू पीपल हैव बीन टॉट दैट प्रूव दैट द लैंग्वेज ए टू द पावर एन the language a to the power n and b to the power n is not regular have people been taught that question so i, I do not know because i haven't taught you the pumping lemma through pumping lemma we can prove that the language a to the power n so let me write it <coughs> a to the power n b to the power n is not regular okay so so this can be proved by pumping lemma okay now now can you tell me a automata that accepts this language sir pushdown automata correct so a pda accepts this language now my question is can a turing machine accept this language so so a turing machine the answer is a turing machine can simulate a pda push down automata so any language which is accepted by a push down automata can also be accepted by a turing machine so a turing machine is a superset of every finite automata it can accepts it any language regular language it can accepts a uh, context free language which is accepted by a push down automata so my next question is construct a turing machine to accept the language l is equal to a to the power n b to the power n okay you people just uh, give it try i am just coming in 2 minutes okay okay so any answer hello uh, yes sir okay so any any clue any answer no sir okay okay so so let me uh, draw first a turing machine so first let me put a simple input string that belongs to this language okay suppose i have two a's uh, three uh, two a's and two b's suppose let us say a a b b okay rest of the symbols are b as it is okay now <coughs> the starting input head is at a so what uh, my algorithm will be if i uh, i encounter a uh, first i take the leftmost a okay i mark it as x okay and move to the right
till I hit a rightmost B. That means what I will do, I will go uh, if uh, I take the leftmost uh, uh, leftmost A, I mark it as X and will go till the rightmost B. Okay, I will mark it as Y. Then I will again come back to A, leftmost A, I will mark it 